Do you want to do like an intro? Oh, I was going to do that just on my own. Oh, that's good. Um, oh, actually, I could just do it. Yeah, with you. All right. Hi, my name is Hugo. Today I'm talking to Ned Middlehurst. Ned is the first Australian to go to the Olympics for climbing. So, Ned, tell us a bit about how you found the Olympics. Uh, it was pretty cool. Um, it was a pretty like high profile event because um, it's a multidisciplinary event compared to yeah. other like solely climbing events. We got police escorts, we had like a huge village with like skyscrapers, um, had like a 24 hour food court, um, everyone was really friendly, uh, volunteers everywhere, like lots of free gear and yeah it was just like a really fun trip. Were the, were the routes um, different to normal routes that you get in normal competition? Uh, I wouldn't say they were different, but there was definitely a very like high quality of route climbing. Um, just because they had so much time and only boys and girls, yeah. like only like 20 competitors for each. Yeah. Um, it just made the routes of a higher quality, I reckon. Um, and talk more about the athlete village. What was it like? Did you just get your own room or do you share a room with your coach or with other athletes? So we shared it with other athletes. So I was in a room with a triathlete, an archer, and a shooter. Are they Australian? Or? Yeah, yeah, all Australian. Um, so we had like four floors of, we had four floors of like just Australian people. It's a cool experience to do anyway, yeah. and it's like a cool stepping stone for like hopefully maybe the Olympics. And, yeah, well, yeah, how much chance times. do you reckon you've got of getting into the 2020 Olympics? Well, good question. Um, I reckon it depends how training goes this year. Um, if I get like really strong and kind of keep up with the speed training, then I will might have an okay chance. Um, but there are a lot of strong people in Australia that I've got to beat, so yeah. Uh, and do you think climbing will stay in, in three disciplines all combined in the Olympics, or do you think they'll separate them eventually? I hope they separate it, but I have a feeling it's going to stay as like three disciplines combined. Um, just because it's easier for spectators, um, and also kind of easier to understand. Um, and if it's all combined as one, then you get the general overall best climber instead of like specially boulders and specially lead climbers. But I'd prefer it to be separate, but it kind of does give a more rounded result of who the best overall climber is. Yeah, yeah well, thanks very much, Ned. It was really good talking to you. Yeah, you too, man. Yeah, good luck with your training. And... Thanks.